I'm here today with this Freemio digital photo frame versus this Uhale digital photo frame. Now we have a lot of versions of this and they look quite similar. This is just a little bit smaller than this one, but you can get different versions. So it doesn't really matter that much, but the Uhale or Freemio is the software you use to put photos on this. Now both these frames have the ability to add photos with an SD card, which is quite easy, but I really like to use my phone for this. So I have all my uh, pictures on my phone and I can easily access them and then transfer it to these is, is very, very easy. So this Framio one, it was quite easy to do. You just install the app, the Framio app, and then connect it to this one. Uh, if you're on the same Wi-Fi uh, as this one, you can easily connect and it has a touch screen so you can input your Wi-Fi password. So it was very easy to connect this one. And it's also very easy to get the photos on there. So you can see you have two photos here and you can scroll through them and it immediately takes up the whole size of the frame. So I think that's quite nice. I couldn't set like dimensions or anything. So it did this automatically. Now with the Uhale app, it seems you have a little bit more versatility because you can set the landscape or portrait of the picture. And also if you want full frame, but you still have these edges here and I couldn't seem to figure out how to change that. So I still have these edges on the photo and here I don't have that. And you can just set the focal point of the image if it's in portrait and you want it in landscape mode. So I think the Framio app is the way to go here. Quality wise, they're both quite nice. They don't have that much glare as you can see. So you can see this in uh, broad daylight, but also in the dark. So I think you really want to look for, well, that, that app that you want to use and I'd recommend the Framio one. So even though they both look good, I really recommend this one with Framio.